Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm back with another bonus live read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Taurus. Topic of the reading is, will they ever propose you? Yes or no? Now it's going to be a quick one, so I will not be adding many cards here, but yeah, let's dive into the read. But before I do that, let me remind you, it's a general read. It meant it will not resonate with everyone out there. So pick whatever resonates, I'll leave the rest. And Taurus, let's see, will they ever propose you? The two cards that I could see was... A big yes to be very honest uh, one was the fool and the other one was uh, three of wands maybe you will have to wait for things to unfold but I really see that to be as a yes card um, maybe there is certain things that you need to learn before you could come together before they could propose you before they could like you know get with you uh, but I really see that as a big yes but let's see what what else comes in because maybe that message is for only a few of you, but yeah, let's see. Will they ever propose you? Whoever it is that you want to check this read for, let's start into the read and let's find out. Seven of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Under the deck, we do have Three of Cups. I feel like, you know, the situation that you desire uh, in love will take time to unfold. Again, the same message. I really feel like, you know, maybe the current situation that you are having with this person is something that you can't even figure out. How is it all going to happen? How will ever it, you know, take place in your life where this person will propose you? Maybe you have moved on. They have moved on. Things have changed. They have changed. You have changed. And you don't see things working out. But the, the, the thing here is, I feel like, you know, the divine really wants you to get stable on your own before you could come together with this person where they propose you and they get married to you. Now, maybe, you know, there was some sort of a habit or, you know, unhealthy habit, I would call it, because maybe you were so dependent on them. The divine really wants you to kind of like, you know, get, get control of your life, get hold of your life for yourself right now. And once you have done that, once you have, you know, started becoming okay without them, that's going to be the moment when God is going to bring you this person who's ready to propose you. It's, it seems like, you know, something will happen like that. Maybe you have to better yourself up. They have to better themselves up. And then everything is going to work out. Maybe initially you're going to take a lot of stress when it comes to this connection in the future. But things would not work out. But after that waiting, after that, you know, understanding, maturing up, things will fall into place. And I really feel like, you know, um, you both have to go on individual journeys before you could come together. So I really see a strong potential in this connection going next level, this person proposing you. But before that happens, a lot needs to take place. A lot will happen. A lot of disappointment, a lot of, uh, you know, um, it's, it's, it seems like, you know, you will have to um, break free a lot of unhealthy habits before the two of you would ever come together. But it's 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 going to be completely different i feel like you know for a majority of you there will be a phase when the two of you would not be talking maybe a phase where you have you know chosen to move on to a new person they have chosen to move on to a new person um and then you're going to come together again so i really see that happening for a majority of you but the potential in this connection is very strong to go next level but there will be a phase which is not going to be healthy, beautiful, which is not going to be promising, which is not going to be something that you would feel like, oh my God, it's ever going to work out. You would have that fear that it will never work out. You would probably have that confirmation that it will never work out. And then something will change, something will happen, which is going to bring the two of you together. And that's when this person is going to propose you. Um, you will be having a new beginning after an ending with this person for sure. So yeah, that's very much it. Uh, much it coming up for you for this read. If it was of help, do like, share, and subscribe. Till I do the next read for you guys. Take care. Bye.